Yo, the dynamic duo, facts and law. We back with another one. Episode eight. Eight on um, Joe. Man, how you feeling, bro? Good, man. You know, listen. Feels good to get this deep in this game. Eight is good. Hey, look. I want to. I want to just shout out all the subscribers, all the people that's showing us love. Hey, keep doing that. We're going to keep growing. We're going to keep bringing nothing but the best content. Um, I, ju I just appreciate all the love. Hey, we've been getting some good love, man. I appreciate the uh, the subscribers, the followers, the comments, the reposts. I, c I also appreciate the, the, this particular comment. I've heard it more times than I can count, is that we, we got something here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We got some, so shit. Let's so, get it. Let's you know get what I'm it. Um, I'm excited for. T I'm always excited. You know, you every did. time we do another episode, I'm always excited. But the number one reason I'm excited is because we got a female. This is what this is what they want. You know, this is what yeah. they not. Hey, when y'all gonna get more females on? Hey, I want all the females, rappers, singers, entrepreneurs, anybody that got something going for yourself. Let's female. Hey. We ready for y'all. Let's get it. <laughs> it's funny you say that because we, we was just having a debate about why men call women females because we don't call y'all males. <laughs> Ooh. I don't know. Hey, look. Um, wait, wait. Let me, let's let's introduce her first. Yeah, and yeah, then, yeah. So, and then we're going we gonna to get into that for a second. Let's so, get it. So we have okay. my fellow condor. You dig? Yeah. Miss Bianca Shaw. What's up, baby Yo, girl? What's up? Singer, yeah, songwriter. Rapper, yep. like, dude, that's you MC, all time, you all time talented. Yep, drummer, yeah. Let's get it. Yep, thank y'all for having me. I appreciate being on here, and you know, when I see y'all podcast, I also I enjoy watching y'all. So Let's go. That's what's you up. did. That's what sucks. So, so we just kind of touched on something. You say, why do men call women females? <laughs> yeah, I think people want to know. I don't know. You know what? I feel I like. Answer. I feel like because there's different terms, you can. That's an easy way to say it without being disrespectful, you know. Because you ain't calling everybody a woman, because some of them, you know, a lady or a, a girl. You know yeah, what I'm I saying? I don't want to say just girl. Class, hey, we need more girls. Nah. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> we need to get more women's on here. You did. Yeah, so I think just women in general, because women is plural, but I. I think you know the term women is uh, it's better. better, but I'm also really? not one of those sticklers. I know women who are just like, why do you have to call me queen? Or damn, you know, wow! You know, it's like, what you want them to call you? Don't be you calling me no king. What you, you know? GD? No, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> <laughs> right? Like that's the only reason I would think that. Like, you no, know, I think it's just preference. You know, for for every. That's a good. That, that like, like men who who told y'all it was okay. Like, so, you know, I don't want to. I don't want to offend anybody. But what if saying female you offend? All of them. I mean, you know, that's something to think about. It's listen, never, listen, I'm never very heard. understanding. So if if I was offending someone, I would love for them to let me know, and I won't say let it again. Know. And yeah, let us know yeah. if, you know if, if you're so, offended hey. by by female. You know what I'm saying? I thought I was saying we need more women. Right turn. You know, we need more women. Women's. We need more women's, women's on this show. So, Miss yeah. Bianca, where you from? Let's get in that. I'm from the west side of what Chicago. What side? I hear you. Say that again. Yeah. <laughs> it's west side Best Chicago. side. She's, yeah. You heard her. Y'all don't listen. Hey, it just happens this way, y'all. I know yeah. I know that's what y'all keep thinking. Hey, yeah. listen. Yeah. Hey, yeah. not everybody, yeah. but you know. I mean, come on, man. Yeah. You know? yeah, like one south, two, about one or two south sides. People have this whole south side, west side. They're both equally terrible. Whoa. So. <laughs> and great at the same time. <laughs> yeah, you it know? is. But like when you go to both areas and you see just all the billboards of injury attorneys or McDonald's. <laughs> and I mean, you know. <laughs> liquor stores. Ground, liquor stores. Food and liquor. Kind of strung out. This shit is depressing. <laughs> yeah, you know, and one thing I always tell people. That's something that we only do here in the city. And it's really jokingly. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, yeah. if we go out of town, you see somebody with a, a Chicago hat on, you're like, hey, what's up? Right, then right, you don't care right. where they from. Yeah. Right. We, we cousins now. What's yeah. up, fam? You know, so, you know, that's. Good yeah, I think it's good friendly robbery. We know we dress better and look better and act better out <laughs> west anyway. But, um. <laughs> hey, but what were you saying now? What, what part? Like, what, where at it on the west side? Um, from the. Uh, well, Holy City. The okay. Holy City, huh? <laughs> um, you know, like Garfield Park area. Yeah. So, you know, that's why I was born and raised. Seen a lot, you know, been through a lot of course, you know, living, growing up over there. But it also taught me what I didn't want to become. So it kind of just helped me to 
to shape, you know, the person I wanted to be, along with, you know, my family. Okay, okay. Mom and dad? Oh, yeah. Mm hmm Yeah, we all lived together. They used to call us the Cosby Little Block. Because mm. <laughs> we had family dinner and prayer time. And really? Nights and, yep, so it was just like, you know, we just happened to live there, but the whole block is like a family block. I don't think you get like there a, too much anymore. Yeah, you Negative. know, that, like everybody been over there about the... Negative. Each other, you know, they got mm -hmm. the old people telling you to get Negative. off the grass, mm -hmm. and they still gonna watch out for yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because like no yeah, I don't even know my my neighbors. I don't even know their names. Yeah, you don't want to get to know. Them. <laughs> I, I know, I know some of my neighbors. And, you know, I'm the only one on my block that look like me. So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I say, hey, but my neighbors cool. You know what I'm saying? They watch out for the cribs. And, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, they know what it is. Yeah. But um, you went to what high school was that you went to? <laughs> I don't know. You don't know? I don't know what high school I went to. Oh, okay. I yeah, you, you, you know what time it is. So you know what time it is. Yeah. Hey, another condo. I'm just no, saying. You know, we, no, it's a lot of talented people. Hey, listen, it's a lot. You, Y'all yeah. stay tuned. I'm telling you. I mean, what kind of high school was it? Wasn't it like a art? It's high a fine school? arts high school. Fine arts? Yep. Okay, yeah. Yep. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know I went there for art. Right. You know what I'm saying? And you had to basically audition or bring a portfolio in. They, yeah, when I went, you had to, yeah, I'll draw, paint, all that. That's I how, just do it with talented. That's man. where the film came from. This is my new paintbrush. Is us, you know what I'm saying? You know, paint yeah. these pictures. You know, you do it with words and lyrics. Yeah. I do it with the, you know, visuals. That's, that's dope. I yeah. always wish I knew how to draw. Really, just draw like oh yeah, me too. Yeah. The same thing yeah. over and over again. I, mean, I can't even know. draw nothing. <laughs> I'm saying I don't know. It seemed easy to me, but obviously. You play the drums and all that, and I couldn't do that to save my life. You know what yeah. I'm saying? So, wait, wait, you, wait, what wait, else you play? You play multiple play the drums? drums? Yeah, I play drums. Wow. I, I've like been playing for a while. I don't. I'm not a multi instrumentalist, but I mm -hmm. I can fake any mm -hmm. for mm -hmm. a little bit. Now, don't ask me to go into detail. Right, right, right. Just like a fake footwork a little bit. A fake footwork. Like and, and then you stop and you're like, ah, right, I was right, gonna right. kill it. Nah, I get it. Man. Yeah, you know. I footwork like once a year. Right. Once a year. <laughs> oh shit, we're gonna have to get that. Right. We're gonna get him right here in this circle. Uh, do this stuff once shit. a year. Get facts and do some footwork in this shit. Right, I gotta bring strobe lighting. Look like D D D. Hey, these, hey, we got them all ready. We got our oxygen tag on. Oxygen on deck. Gotcha. Gotcha. Y'all out. So, how many siblings you um you you have? I got five. Got two older brothers, older sister, two younger sisters. That are twins, and we just I don't know. We had a lot of fun growing up. Yeah, no fighting, none of that. Of course, of course. Know, of course. And you in the middle, huh? Yeah, I always. Well, I'm the beloved child. Oh, <laughs> the beloved child. Explain. Explain. You, know what I'm saying? you in the middle. You ain't too young. You ain't yeah. super spoiled. Mm -hmm. You still got a chance to learn from your older ones. Like you know, I got. I was fortunate enough to have older and younger siblings, so it helped me, you know, to kind of just mold my character a little better. You did. Um, and I don't have you know younger brothers, but I don't really. I didn't miss out on that since I have nephews. Right. Okay. Like we were around the same age. Yeah. So you had your older siblings. They are how much older would you say? Oh, I don't, I don't even know that. <laughs> no, okay, they was grown like, enough to have yeah, kids. Yeah, I'm like eleven years younger than my gotcha. oldest brother. Gotcha, gotcha. Mm. So, so that makes sense. Like a father figure, like mm -hmm. he got me into hip hop too. Okay, you know, really? So he just he taught me a lot about life and just how to you know kind of fend for myself, take care of myself. So you say he got you into hip hop. <laughs> <laughs> he got you into who hip hop? Who was he listening to? Man, he was listening to that person on the wall. He was that, to Tupac, you, you got, uh, wait, Def, which person? Tupac. Tupac. Tupac yeah. Biggie, Def, MF Doom. Mm. Um, who else was he listening to? Uh, Outkast, Wu Tang. Good shit. All the nineties, you know, rapper Cam. Yeah. Cam. So with that being said, who are some of your like favorite artists or influences? I would say. My favorite, just because I'm a woman and come from that, you know. A woman. A, 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 mm, I learned something. I personally just don't never say it, call myself a female, but it's just because I'm a, a woman. Like y'all, it's always gonna be different for me. I can no do that. Women. We don't say hey, I'm a male. I mean, so you're yeah. right. I get it. It's yeah. always gonna be different because we got different perspectives. So it's like at in one point, like some of y'all will never understand some of the things we go through, but you can, um, you can relate. I guess. Mm -hmm. um, well, you can understand but not relate. I don't know how I want to say that. <laughs> I get um, it. I get you it. just would never get it, and I yeah. we would never get where y'all come from. Yeah. Say it again. You see, some people need to understand that. 
We different. Right. Right. That's we different. it. We different. Yeah. Right. And that's that's it. That's all. Like you can just explain your point of view and just hope to get some understanding. But uh, my favorites are like Lauren Hill, Missy Elliott, and mm. Badu. Okay. Eve. You know, I like all those. I can dig that. Uh, I can dig that. No look Kim. I like Lil Kim, but Lil Kim and Nicki Minaj, I like them, I like, like their music, but I didn't grow up like, man, I really like, I want to be like this. Yeah. But I listen to their music and I admire mm -hmm. you know, them for who they are right. and being a staple in, in hip hop. Um, but it's just my personal opinion, man. When did you know you had the talent? That like, when did you know, do you remember your first bar? Your first yeah, I do. Can, you feel like I do. We sharing like it. Up. Oh my god! Everybody oh. can be asking. You feel like spitting that? <laughs> <laughs> no, we got. We, we, need, we need to hear that. Like, what was your yeah, first I rhyme? I'll, I'll spit it for y'all. But I, I started because I seen Bad Wall on TV, and I always okay. always give him his flowers because I mean that's how I I'm the, like man maybe I could do that. He was a kid. He was rapping. Yeah. I'm like that man looks cool, and I thought he was cute. So I'm like maybe <laughs> I could be his girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> so. So you pick, you decide to pick up the pencil and see. Huh? Yeah, so I started yeah. writing. I wrote like forty-eight bars. Really? Just straight through. Now take it to my uh, friend. Shout out to David Miles, like at my grammar school. But he was like, yeah, okay, you could change this. You could do mm -hmm. this. Which I still think he's one of the like a really great uh, rapper. I don't, I don't think he pursued it past that point. Okay. But um, but we were always just kind of in there going over lyrics and stuff. So nice. I wrote it. I spent it in front of this um, summer camp. And they was going crazy. Really? Like, cause How I, old were you? I, I didn't talk. I was like 11. Yeah. 11 or 12. And I didn't really talk much. So the, I think that was just shots. Yeah. Like, like, where, is, where is this coming from? And who are you? Why don't you bring this out in class? All right. So I so. just kind of was sitting there. And I, they was acting like I wanted to. The six ring or something. They was picking me up. Like, oh, that's <laughs> cool. hey, hey, that's what did it. And that's what she was yeah. like. I'm like, man, I'm in. Yeah. So yeah. I, so, but I wish I kept one out in high school, though. Honestly. Oh, you didn't do it. You, you, you didn't really do your music in high school. No, I was writing, but mm -hmm. I wasn't doing the lunch table. Even though I could beat, like yeah. I, I could do. Real, nobody knew I could play drums or like I was. So really wait, real beat on you the didn't table. go to go to Curie for music? No. What did you go I for? Went for video production. Oh well, and here we are. <laughs> Nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like broadcasting. Yeah, so I went to college for it too, and I did not use it, but I mean, I can you can? Yeah, like, you listen. Music, you got to do that shit early, <laughs> like early, because you got to get to where you're going, and you got to have the strength and hey. agility to keep going. Like, yeah, no, she's, she's, she's still in spit. Yeah, I was, I was about to. I was, I was on my way back. You know, that's, that's why I was looking. Like, like, yeah, she's uh, yeah. comfortable. Yeah. Gonna start talking with yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's all good. We're gonna get you right back to that verse. Uh, you gonna let us hear it or oh, you know man, what I'm saying? Don't be Speak up. At me. All right, we ain't gonna stare. We're just gonna let the camera, camera stare. Yeah. Uh, camera, y'all stare at us while we. I, get, I don't know if I remember all of it. Just give us a little taste. We're trying to see what them bars was at. At 11, yo. My name is Bianca Shaw. I'm less than four feet tall. Don't get discriminated. Don't be discriminating because you know I ain't that small. Um, 11 years old, don't know what you've been told. I'm the new kid on the block and I'm going to drop it like it's hot then. I'm going to take a shot to bring it up to the top. Yeah, you seen the rest, but it's time to check out the best. See, while I'm still a team, my money go chain chain. People come <laughs> up to me trying to bling bling. See, I'm too king. I can't be seen. And these niggas try to holler just to get some dollars. I'm a shorty from the Windy City. Yes, yes, I'm from the best. I'm from the West. Oh! The best. <laughs> hey, Chicago hey. is where I'm from, so back off, son, because you don't won't none. Hey, listen, <laughs> listen, 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 listen. Hey, at eleven, at 11 that's though. better than a lot of these clowns out right now. <laughs> at eleven, <laughs> and rhymed it. You did, you know what I'm saying? We hey, like that. You ain't catch no flag for saying the N word. Nah, nah that right. was younger. What? No, I'm just what I'm saying, saying like, but you, you know, this is no, no. Hey, you didn't spit it in front of like you was you was spinning in front of your peers. Yeah, my oh, peers. Oh, right, 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 right. Adults right. too. That was like, yeah, wow. but yeah, oh, okay. So that was, adults was probably what a 16 year old camp counselor. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, facts, yeah. Facts. yeah. So yeah. that was dope. No, I'm yeah. telling you, that's better than a lot of these. <laughs> Artists yeah. out here right now, you know what I'm saying? I so. attempted to ghostwrite a couple of times. They was like, honestly, I don't hear anybody singing this but you, <laughs> or like rapping mm -hmm. but you, which is a gift and a curse because that means you sound different enough to make it. But you want to be able to adhere, you know, to assimilate to mm -hmm. whoever you like working with mm -hmm. and make it sound like them. S so when, you, so I'm sure you've written for people before, haven't you? Yeah. So when you write for them, do you sit down and write as them, or do you write something for yourself and? So yeah, that's how, how I learned to write as them. Right, you know, you know what I'm saying? To try okay. to do that as opposed to like, okay, I like this, I like the way this goes, but 
um, yeah, so I, I try to listen to them. But the problem with that is sometimes you get stuck in one zone. Mm -hmm. So if I listen to too much Nicki Minaj, which I was at one point, mm -hmm. like she was doing like Donk and like she was doing the mixtape. Yeah. Like, uh, Wayne. It messes with your flow. The time I started to sound like I'm like, yo, uh, yeah. <laughs> like I have to turn this off and just get back to me. Mm -hmm. So I don't want to, you know, so like sometimes I don't listen to other artists when I'm creating because I don't want to get stuck in. I can dig that. Wow, nation. it makes sense. I never thought about. Well, I'm not an artist, so yeah. I never thought about. Yeah, like you listening to other people and you yeah. just get even. Yeah, even when you writing or like, let's say. I'm writing a script right now, right? Yeah. Certain things I will watch and then certain things I try to avoid yeah. because I don't want it to come off like I'm trying to do what somebody else is right. doing. You know, because it, it's going to influence you. You write scripts? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, no. <laughs> what you been, Bianca? Oh, so, listen. Really when, been out <laughs> when y'all get a chance, right, go to Tubi. You can watch Mr. Mata online. You know, you got Valentino in it, Spiller. Bunch of artists from the city. Oh, you know what I'm mm. saying? Not only that, we had the premiere right at on Home and in Roosevelt back in 2018. I so was you there. know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, was there. I know. Whatever y'all doing, let me know. So we got you. Oh, we sure. got yeah. you. You are sure. officially part yeah. of the Facts and Law family anyway. Sure. So yeah. you know what time it is. Okay. So let's um get a little bit more into your music. So I know you've been an artist for years, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? But what's your most recent project that you that you got going? Tell us about about it. Yeah, my uh, my question. most recent project was Get a Real Job and I did <laughs> I did that because um I, I was just reminiscing about all the times, you know, I've had people close to me just say, Well, why don't you just go get a job? Well, why don't you just mm -hmm. get a real job? It's like I do work, okay? Yeah. I just don't work Mm -hmm. how you work yeah. you know like yo get up at six make it there by eight get off five make it home by six you got three hours to yourself like i do a bunch of like other yeah. jobs mm -hmm. like, i drum you know mm -hmm. and then i do like pa gigs or i'll do like stand-ins and just other different things to make me money just entrepreneur un being an entrepreneur and also doing your music and up finding other means to make money yeah so that's where that that project came from is like as long as you getting it you know <laughs> then get it because my mom you know one time i was asking her to watch uh the twins for me the I twins have, huh what twins? twins i have twins they running at the family i heard i picked up on that she said yeah, she had two twin did. siblings yeah, so and I, I was getting to that i was getting to that yeah and the lord i guess right saves I me but i gotta make sure i tell people like when i'm dating and stuff like i have twins so they won't be like you got the same baby daddy like, oh, 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 hey with oh, twins oh, i hope so yeah, right. so, so boy and girl, what you, what, what, yeah, boy, boy and girl, perfect. Yeah, I know, hey, listen, when you said it on the record, I know you said it on uh, what was that song? Yeah, I said oh. it on a couple of people, still be like, I didn't know you had this. I'm like, well, I kind of want it that way, but yeah. I'll sprinkle them on something, yeah, every now you know. and then. but yeah, the twins are cruel, cruel, like for no reason, you know. And yeah. it's one of the things, yeah, I get it. I, I don't, I, yeah. I, I really like to, I sprinkle my kids on my mm -hmm. social. Cause you know, I remember getting in, like getting into it, talking to somebody, and they really? they, yeah, online, and they try and go and find they pictures of your, kids mm -hmm. and talk shit. Yeah, exactly. I'm like, listen, don't have me out here in the street trying to find you because of some internet shit. Right. I'm too. I'm. Uh, we we elevated past that, but a few years crazy. back, boy, I was like, yeah. nah. I know, I just block them. Yeah, they do shit yeah. on purpose, especially like if you verify what they see you with somebody, mm -hmm. you know, they just mm -hmm. say shit. They try to say shit on purpose to get you blocked. I mean, yep. to get your oh, yeah. page Take it. Uh, yep. taken away. Yeah, that's so crazy. They want you reporting comments that ain't problems. Yeah, first they gonna, it's ha it's. Hackers and this trolls that have come on there. This it be the people that say the meanest things that have zero followers. <laughs> fake page, like, yes, fake page, no pictures on fall it. Into yeah, the trap. yeah, that and is I wild, that, man. Like, cause I'm like, hey, you, you just talk all that shit. They gonna report my comment. I'm all right. So right. I see what type of game. I learned that a minute ago. So what you just just ignore them now? You just block them. I ignore them. Sometimes I go back. You know, like. Depend on the mood. It does. Hey, I get it. I see hey, listen. The slick shit though, like good luck at the National Awards next year. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that, 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 that. Right. 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 <laughs> we gotta get them slick. So you know, I don't know what that feels you. like. Hey, listen. I a lot of times, bro. I, it depends on. Listen. You catch me late at night, and I probably didn't have one. I might scroll some comments. And yeah. I, sometimes I find myself talking. Yeah. Typing the whole comment and it's deleted. So you gotta get you another page on Kevin. You dig? I need to give me a burner. Pull a KD. You know what I'm saying? Well, I don't know why you talking about her. Like you gotta go and do your own thing. 
<laughs> now, I, I tried that. I got kicked off Twitter twice. Dang. See, I need to follow you. I never been kicked, kicked off. I don't got one no more. I never got what? kicked off any uh, social media. Man. You ain't talking yeah, that yeah. shit then. No, I don't. I, like, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna stunt. I don't be talking shit on, on uh, social media. On social media. It's no. Pointless. But I got a question for y'all. What, what do you think about people who stay neutral in situations? Like how you said, like, you never got kicked off Twitter. And yeah. I know you had an opinion about things. You probably just didn't. Pick a side for me. <laughs> Pick a side. Yeah. I want so to. I just want to know what y'all think. Like, and celebrities, like, take a, into account, like, what they may be feeling or mm -hmm. going through. Like, okay. <laughs> like, okay. Mm -hmm. Like, I can't. I mean, I, I speak my. That's what we were talking about yeah. earlier. What? When, when Michael Jordan didn't pick a side with his political views. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That he's a setup. And people look at, yeah, like, but, but, at him negatively for that. Yeah, but at the time, like, look, my thing is, if I'm a 26 year old hooper, at 26, I didn't care about politics like that. I'm going to keep it real. No, I didn't. I didn't. You know what I'm saying? I didn't, That's probably the last thing that was on blood mine. Mm -hmm. So it's like, you know what I'm saying? As I got older, closer to 30, it makes more sense. I think I did. You know what I'm saying? At 26, I think I did because I believe that's when Barack was. Yeah, uh, see, I was about 30. Yeah, you was you older, did, you know older than me. So. Yeah, I think that's when I took it. I ain't give a damn about no yeah, politics. Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? You know what so age? it's like for, for you to come ask me in front of the camera, yeah. if I don't know, I'm just going to be like, I, don't, right. I ain't got no comment. Right. You know what I'm saying? You <laughs> yeah, like, bro, I'm here to hoop. Like, I, I don't, think, do change. I don't yeah. think I'm mad at, at Michael Jordan for that, though. Because I feel like, you know, it's sometimes I feel like sports should stay sports. Mm -hmm. And politics is just stay if you politics. passionate about it, but you if got you, something to say. But I do support uh, Colin Kaepernick. That's you know what I mean? I'm the only person mm -hmm. that okay. took a knee in a, in a in a military uniform. Gang. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Gang. And posted it. And then what makes it so bad is <laughs> people don't even realize that taking a knee is a form of respect to a lost comrade. You feel me? Mm -hmm. And it was he was told to do that <laughs> by a Officer, a uh, soldier. Right, right, you know right, what I'm saying? Yeah, Marie but you know, told him to do that. But you know how it goes. You know what I'm saying? Let's flip yeah. that narrative. And oh, it's bad and all that. Right, and what about us? <laughs> yeah. all That's about disrespectful. It's like saying <laughs> a building on fire. You but what about my house? Right. Bitch, your house ain't on fire. But it's, 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 it's a gift and a curse <laughs> as well, though. Yeah. Because you can... You can see your money get taken, like count you. What they call it? Can, what they call it? Cancel, cancel culture. Cancel, cancel culture. Mm -hmm. it's called like ball. yeah, black ball, mm -hmm. all that. Do you want to get black ball, or do you want to stand for something? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I can't. I don't know. I can't. It's, it's, don't have haters. Like that's you can't please everybody. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. So you are gonna take a stand for something or fall for anything, and that's a really right. true statement. Like. You know, even with friends, where well, yeah, I'd be mm -hmm. like, okay, well, why didn't you? You gotta pick a side, because right is right, wrong is wrong. That's it. Like, <laughs> some of these people will never be in our shoes. You don't know what, what it's like unless you was born a black man. Period. Or born a black woman. So how can you tell these people that their views are not validated? Because you didn't experience that. Big facts. Facts. And Big that's, facts. That's, <laughs> something that, that's something that they, you know, they need to understand, but they never will. So I want us as a people to stop trying to make them understand. Only thing we could do is educate them on it and hey, going about our business. Take them to the river, you can't make them drink. You know right. what I'm saying? You yeah. gotta put, them, put, put, it, put the information there in front of them. They can do what they want with it. Yeah. You know what I mean? And, I, and I'm one of those ones where it's like, like you gotta pick your battles. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If you're gonna go to war, you gotta be prepared for war. Mm -hmm. So if you know you're gonna take on that establishment that can take your money, what you got in the bank? Can you survive yeah. when those consequence, consequences yeah. come? You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So it's always, to me, it's always, you got to look at the pros and cons of it, the so, causes and effects. You, you just got to be smart. Yeah. yeah. Once, once it's like from day one, mm -hmm. you have to be smart with your money. So when you do encounter anything like Lepoxy, that. say plan, plot, strategize. <laughs> you dig <laughs> what I'm saying? Some people that stay out of that. Like, who stay? Who, who's neutral? Yeah. We like, don't know because they just know. be chilling. I don't know, you don't really hear about the neutral. You know what's funny? My, most of the coolest celebrities, like the, the neutral ones, are the ones who stay out the limelight. Mm -hmm. But they'll tell you everything and give y'all like 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 know. this talking and all yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. but you know they don't. Yeah. But and that could be a motherfucker like Jordan. Don't ask me in front of the camera because mm -hmm. I'm not gonna get into that. Yeah, you don't want to know my opinion because y'all gonna look at me this way or the other or whatever. Yeah. Now, if we smoking a cigar, <laughs> we talking yeah, then. Like you know what I'm saying? So you know. 
Gotta, hey, pick your battles. I think Beyonce and Jay Z stay out of shit. They, they do. I think so, but <laughs> I they know Jay. They stay. I think they stay out of it, <laughs> voicing their opinion. Beyonce definitely. They, they, do, they do their work. Yeah, they do their with work. The work and you can't yeah. say nothing about yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, right. We ain't got to talk yeah, about right, it. We just right. doing the work. Yeah, you're definitely that's the, right. Hey, because you definitely right. You about catch that. all the flack you want. God damn it. Y'all don't know what we doing. Did she make a statement? She made a Beyonce made a statement marching or doing something on the. Well, I forgot what it was. She be happy to get you. No, no, no. It was a no, no, no. It was a good statement. What oh, I'm yeah, saying yeah. is, All she, that. she, she did a good statement. I, I forgot what it was. I think she marched out in all black or something like that. Oh no, no, she did the um the performance wearing the. The that was the, the black to the Panther, Panther, right? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So like, yeah, she ain't yeah gotta, I ain't shit no, I ain't shit no to be high. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what time it is? No, I'm saying they gonna get you because y'all remember how. Oh, because because I'm not. Hey, I don't listen to no, Beyonce. I, I, I mean, I'm gonna be keeping one. I ain't like I'm finna pop in an album, but I, I did watch that um that joint with the wife and kids, Joe. The um the African joint. The visual album, Lion is King. Lion is King. Yeah. Joe, I watched that because I know it was vision. It was dope, visually dope. You know what I'm saying? I watch it though, you but I ain't seen it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So you know that's what I'm saying. No, I never seen Check it. Like it I don't, I haven't even listened to nothing Beyonce. Well, see, I ain't even look at it as listening. Yeah, it ain't like you know I'm turning. Hey, put on there. No, I'm just I saying mean, like yeah. other stuff. Huh? We're just letting the Beehive know it was him. It yeah, was him. it was me. It, it was me. It wasn't even y'all. It was me, y'all. That's a good one. So listen, it go back me. to this this album. Get a real job. Oh yeah, I keep getting out. No, it's all oh, good. This is what we do. We talk about what hey, we fine, want. This is our show. Yeah. You dig? We do what we want. Yeah. We do we do what we want. <laughs> what we want. You feel me? Yeah, but I mean that was uh, the basis of it, you know. But that's how we got off the two and I'll talk started talking about the twins but yeah um, that was me well, my, bad. my bad segue <laughs> but i asked my mom like yeah can you watch it because it was my first paid gig that was when i first had it they're seven now so just to put, put mm -hmm. it in perspective so when i first had them so I'm like, oh, i got a seven year old can you watch them and um and she was like well what are you going to do i'm like i'm going to work i'm doing something i love mm -hmm. <laughs> you know mm -hmm. she was like oh so not a real job uh, so i was like i'm ooh. going to perform and that was my uh, first my first gig that i got paid it was like 500 dollars. so i'm mm -hmm. like i'm getting paid 500 to go and do something right? I love. Right. Go some people make that in a week I'm like, how much you gonna pay in eight hours? Yeah, like, mm -hmm. I, I want to go and make mm -hmm. my money. This right. is a job, like because it's not in a suit. Right, and, nine to five. You know, and I've done that. <laughs> I still do. You know, I go you corporate, know, corporate yeah. and. You know, it's nothing there but a bunch of egotistical <laughs> people who want to be the boss, but they ain't. But they yeah. gonna make you feel lesser because you have a position that's, you know, beneath them. But is it really? Because I, I mean, I don't know. I, I just feel like up. Uh, up here in here that's that's what matters you know and, and, and you know I, just to piggyback on that mm -hmm. i feel you because you'll get into these situations where somebody that think because they were there the month before you <laughs> They above you. You didn't like, like, bro. You can't hold a candle to me in life. Right. You did what I'm saying. Like, dressing room. Like, oh no, you can't come in. Oh, bitch, you are in war. Right. Okay, I know the actual director. Right. You feel like, like, go up there and say, what's up? Come back right. me. Like, how dare you? You know what I'm saying? So they just never, you never, you know never know who you're dealing with. I'm trying to tell you. Yep. So it, it just, oh, but back to the. Yeah, we good. Yeah, hey, let's let it. We can go wherever we want. You did what I'm saying. This is our shit. Well, no, nah, I, I hope you know if y'all take a listen to it. But I put a couple of voicemails on there. Yeah, I got my I, brother. I heard I got yeah, we heard mom, I got her twins. mom, the twins. I got, yeah, I got friends. Know. You know, just to kind of put everything into perspective. You know, so shout out to everybody. Where you get that idea me. from? To do that. that. I mean, I was just thinking about it one day, like that conversation I had with my mom yeah. and what I had with, you know, someone else who should not be named. And then like two, three other people that's just like try to talk about mm. you for pursuing something that they didn't have the yeah. balls to go and do. Mm -hmm. So why are you mad at me? I didn't do shit. Right. I do what, you know, was put on my heart. It looked like it's going great for you because I'll tell you what, that first show. So let's see you you in front of them big stages like what was that Lala or something? Yeah, yeah. Know. How did my, yeah. how did that feel then? Um, that man, that was electrifying. Mm -hmm. And I'm 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 gonna get back on that stage. Okay. Hey. What about the Hyde Park Fest? You heard about this one? 
I have. I ain't, Hyde Park ain't called me for they festival. Let's see what we can do. <laughs> I'm, 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 I might know a guy. I like Harold's. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Sometimes, you know, it ain't oh, it ain't oh, Uncle like, Remus, but you know. <laughs> It ain't like right. It ain't Uncle Remus, though. Then <laughs> <laughs> Uncle Remus getting shut down, right? There you go. What? He's, what? Hey, don't worry about my nephew, y'all. What? He's a hater. They said all the Uncle Remus are getting shut down in July. Right, what? All of them. Not the one in Bill. Oh, you don't know. Oh, they said okay. all of them. Who is they? Oh, they're going up. It's been going all around. Right. Who is they? The internet. <laughs> <laughs> the internet. The internet. Hey, I gotta see that. Not I internet. That. Internet. <laughs> internet. Y'all know how I talk about the Listen. internet. Yo, what's good, people? It's your boy, Facts, one half of the dynamic duo, Facts and Law. You know what I'm saying, the Facts and Law podcast. I know you heard of it. If you haven't, shame on you. I'm letting y'all know right now where we at, Good Energy Studio. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can come here, do your thing, podcast, music encoding, mixing and mastering, movie scoring, listening sessions, promo commercials. What more do you need? This is where you need to be. You can check them out on IG, Good Energy Studio, and online. Check it out, goodenergystudio.com. You heard it here first. Your boy, Fax, signing off. Peace. When did you know that hip-hop was, was about to be something that you was about to take serious? And... <laughs> you don't remember? You know, you know, we had went to the... Uh, we were talking about how that, fit, that feeling on... On the Lala, Lala stage, oh. you said because you said yeah, 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 we were talking about that. Yeah. Mm, but you said you had you didn't take it serious in high school. I didn't. I didn't know no better. I didn't have the guidance. But what made you take it serious though? Yeah. I guess when what I went quit? To, we good? Oh, damn, we yeah. Oh damn! I guess uh, when I went to college, uh, there was this guy. His name was Brian Kenner. We stayed in co-ed dorms. He was right across the hall from me. He's like, yeah, I do music. I'm like, oh really? And were you really playing already right? then too? Were you no. playing the drums then? Mm, I didn't take. I wish I was in drumline okay. in uh, high school. Mm -hmm. I, I wish I had told the gospel choir I could play. Right. I I didn't speak up. Like I said, I was quiet, mm -hmm. and I didn't really find myself until I went to school and lived on my own. Gotcha. I was still, it happens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Some bubble like mm -hmm. I never went to homecoming games. None of that. Mm -hmm. I hate being looked at. I didn't mm -hmm. like nobody to. I was scared to go on dates. Like, Word. Guys used to ask me all the time, like, hey, you want to go? I'm like, uh, no. I'm like, no. thank you. <laughs> thank you. I'm like, I gotta go home and do something. Do something. <laughs> it had nothing to do, huh? I don't like doing shit. I don't want to watch Charm Double Header. Damn. Right. <laughs> Wow. Hey, but you know it'd be like I was, that. I was writing books. Like I used to go home just write on the computer and teach myself shit. I wouldn't. That's what's up. But I mean, then you get to college and people like, so what are we doing? It's like oh, I thought you wanted to watch a movie. <laughs> like that's not what they want. That to ain't. Do. That's oh. not what we're here for, huh? right? right? Like, like well, you just don't be prepared. But like well, I Netflix was, and chill. Yeah, <laughs> it was blockbuster, <laughs> homie. It was, like, it was blockbuster. <laughs> yeah. It was Netflix. I just I Hollywood video. No, it was Redbox. One Redbox, Redbox, Redbox DVDs. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's what that was. Yeah, Redbox just a hit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, Redbox. For the dollar. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's retarded. Yeah, they gonna charge you seventy five dollars. <laughs> but you were speaking on um, how electrifying um, Lala was. Lala was. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. Like they knew my lyrics. Really. How that make you That's feel? That's what's oh, up, y'all. Yeah, how that make you mm -hmm. feel, y'all? There's yo. so many people there. Like, mm -hmm. I still got the picture, and I have it on my EPK because I just thought that was the coolest thing ever. I never thought it would be so many people just, like, singing it along with me, mm. you know? And then, you know, Twister came out. So, shout, shout out to the Taylor Bennett, you know, just... You did? You know, yeah, like, shout out. You, that's yeah, that's the they, team, they, they or yeah, they, yeah. They believed in me. They always gonna be the team, you mm -hmm. know, but they believed in me, you know, when nobody else really was giving me a shot. So how I did, always. So how did that come about? Yeah. Because you know I knew you before the end, and you know what I'm saying. Then I saw you was rocking. I say, oh, okay. I'm just curious. How did that come about? Yeah, no, it, it was a complete like my guy David. Shout out to David Willard too, because he like he was like, uh, yeah, you know, um, I know Chance and Taylor's dad, and he said he want to come and check us out because uh, Taylor's got this performance coming up on Windy City Live. So I'm like, okay. Shout out Windy so, City Live. They just yeah, canceled it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they they super nice, uh, just really genuine people. Like mm -hmm. I come across a lot of good souls. Mm -hmm. But um, so he came down there, and it just so happened that day, like how God worked like the drummer was sick <laughs> like Work. shout out to Paris like that's my guy still to this day he mm -hmm. helps me with the drums but he never missed the rehearsal 
And on all days, this man was sick. Mm. And David was like, hey, can you fill in on drums for us? You know all the music. And I'm like, all right. So, <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> what if I say no? Right. right. So I'm like, I filled in on drums. He came down there. He looked at what we were doing. And then he, yeah, I guess he was looking at me. And he was like, oh, she's pretty cool with that hat on. So he was like, uh, show us a song that, you know, if it was the only song you could show me, and it would just blow me away. Just show me a song right now, you know, just do a song for me. And this is Taylor? Uh, this is his dad. Okay, uh, his dad. Bennett. Gotcha. And, and shout out to Ken, too. So he he came, and David was like, hey, B, let's do Blue Ballad. Let's do Blue So that's one of my songs from my old project. Gotcha. So I hopped off the drums. I started singing. And then I started with the rap in between, because mm. that's how I like to do Yeah, my yeah, we know, songs. we know. Like the, the song, you go into rap, and he was just like... You should check this girl out. You mm -hmm. know, like she's she's really dope. So dope. after that, it just kind of went from there. So they, you know, we met up mm -hmm. and we talked, and it was just nice. Gone from there. I see. I've been a lot of places. Drop some of the the things that you've done. Hey, I've seen you speaker. doing all kind of things. You know what I'm saying? Tell me about that. <laughs> Tell me some of those those um. So what's bad. some of your favorite experiences thus far in the business doing what you do? Man. My favorite experiences are honestly meeting the fans. And yeah. I'm not even going to lie to you. I met a lot of nah. people and, you know, people that mm -hmm. I've always wanted to meet mm -hmm. and, and seen. But it's really the fans that give you that energy because they like, oh, my God. Like, like I've got people giving me gifts or they give me, like, a, a Etta James vinyl, which I still got. Mm, that's I'm, what's I'm up. I'm like, damn, how did you know I liked Etta James? They be, I never hey, talked about this before. Do they research? Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, I never talked about that. I'm mm, like, look oh, on so the, uh, just like, oh, you just on the rim. Me they could hear it in, hey, something about it. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, I've gotten that before. We're like, you remind me of Erica Badu. Or like, you like a Lauryn Hill on steroids. Or, mm -hmm. You know, and these are my favorite people. Yeah, when it, but when it's your influences, people will hear that. You know what I'm yeah. saying? They'll get that vibe because that's a vibe that you're um, putting out, but putting it out, like, like wholesomely and, and truthfully. You know what I'm yeah. saying? They really, they get it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You're not trying to do it. You just... You know, that's Got what it. you like. You yeah. know what I mean? It's not the same way if, let's say, if he was rapping more vulgar yeah. kind of lyrics and they give you a little Kim CD. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, you'll be yeah, like, yeah, because yeah, this is my kind of shit. You know, but you know what I'm yeah, saying? But but. That's why I like, you know, what me, and not to say that, but I like listening to my whole catalog one day and I'm like, I'm a fan. <laughs> you should be. <laughs> you should be. I don't know, not just because it's me, but I'm like, this yeah. is different. You mm -hmm. know, it's. It's the type of music you want to hear. Yeah, I can rap with, with the best and hold my own. And mm -hmm. I can sing with the best and hold my own. And then I could go mm -hmm. drum with Sheila E. at the Grammys. And Let's go. Home. I'm nice. like, this is Let's like, go. Speak nice. it into existence yes, then. Sir. Yeah, this, you that's dig? just something I really, you know, ad admire. Like, no matter if it's Rihanna or, or Lil' Kim or Megan or who, whoever oh. your favorite artist right. is, I'm going to do you say? me on the track. Right now, who's your favorite new artist outside of yourself? Um, new artist. Dang, you know, I gotta, I gotta, y'all gotta put me on a few people, but I like Lil Baby, I like Roddy Rich. Okay. Like, uh, they ain't new no more. Oh, like, you gotta put me yeah. on them too. Yeah, <laughs> I, mean, I, like, I like them for, oh. they, I like artists who express themselves. Yeah. Just, I saw somebody that, um, I think you had a show with that was Facts and Law Family. What you think about Rio Ty? Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't think. Yeah, yeah, really. I didn't have a That's what's up, show yeah. with him, but I, I met him. You met him. You told okay. You told me you met him recently. Yeah, I met him. So I don't know. You know Shout out Leo Ty. Yeah. Shout out Rio. Hey, listen, he got work on some shit. So I'm, you know, I'm down to work with. With the artist, hey, let's shit, set it up. I'm yeah, gonna, I'll make a phone call. I think we have time. Fire. Let me, yeah. fire, let me see. What, let me see what I can do. Like listen to Hey, we got. Hey, we got some more great, great, great Chicago artists. They may be from the West Side, not saying yeah, that, but but listen, side, listen, yeah. but we got some great artists coming right. and we have a great artist on the show with us. You know what I'm saying? We yes, just want to make sure that y'all yes, get in tune. Listen, great music, ladies, gentlemen, y'all like it. We love it. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of liking and love it, we ready for the facts? Hey, we ready? Yeah, you ready? We ready for the you facts ready? of all favor, yes, folks? I'm ready. Look, look, this look, one we, don't worry about it. Right, this listen. one we pick. For your favorite, for our favorite tracks from your catalog, okay. from your you catalog, we're gonna vibe you know, out to it, and then let us know. tell us a little bit about the exactly. song after we play it. You know where it came from, your inspiration, and we gonna rock out like that. Yes, sir. What we got? To, what we got up first? I hate you. 
Okay. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm hmm. Tell us about that joint. Where were you when you wrote that? Like mentally, Science? I would say what? Well, like where yeah, were you? Science yeah. is called science. Uh, mentally, I just wanted to talk shit because I get tired of people trying to kind of put you in a box. Like, look, I can go everywhere. Okay. <laughs> so I just wanted to. I, I write music based on how I feel. Mm. And how I felt was I'm just. Let's go. Trying to let y'all know that this. I wanted to do something a little different. Mm. I don't know. Like you're just singing. The melodies over a beat like that, and then just putting your your bars in there. Mm -hmm. and you know, I could do both. I'm gonna just, you know, who dig produced that? Dig that. Um, who produced who produced signs? Hold on, cause I had like four four producers on that on that um, album. You gonna have to give me a second. Oh yeah, you good, you good. But yeah, I, hey, I like that joint. You know what I'm saying? You was spitting. You know what I'm saying? That's in the meantime, hey, check out our sponsor. Your real hair. Oh Go yeah, yeah, yeah. To yeah, the IG hair. page. Hey, y'all see yeah, the beard? The beard. I put some on today before did. I left the crib. You did. The beard is glistening. It's shining. Yeah, I'll you see won't what be time disappointed. You did. You know what it is. Yeah. Yourrealhair.com. Yes, sir. <laughs> you did. You know. <laughs> hey, we got. <laughs> hey, we got to put it out there. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm saying? Got to pay some bills. Yeah. No, gotta, I feel that. Got to pay I, some bills. I agree with that. You did. Well, I don't know what his um. His producer name is, Ooh. but I met him a while ago. His name is Eric. Mm. Uh, Eric, good, Eric good shit. Eric Shottown Music. Okay. Um, I, I will have to ask him about that, because all I have is just what I gave him credit for, for his uh, publishing. Dig that. So so let me ask you this, because you say, you know, sometimes, I know you write a lot, them lyrics, so you, you have to rehearse when you're going to perform, make sure you got them yeah, songs yeah. right? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I forget my lyrics, mm -hmm. and sometimes really? the band be like, "That is not the part." That's the band. <laughs> right. And I be like, <laughs> "Right." You freestyling? You don't wear it. Right. You don't wear it. <laughs> I've worn one one time. The time uh, I worn one one time, and it was just such a shock to me. You know, because I'm just used to kind of doing it without mm -hmm. any vocal processor. I just kind of sing like back, to, like in church. Yeah, mm -hmm. just kind of sing. But there's no sense in putting all that stress on your vocals when you could have like some auto tune or something up there. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I just didn't have. I didn't have anybody to guide me. That's how I know I would be a dope manager, consultant, or whatever when it comes to you know. Uh, just someone who's trying to come up. Yeah, because you're uh, learning this business and. I'm not no gatekeeper. I, uh -huh. I don't have no secrets. If you want to know, you know, just hit me up and I'll be happy to, to help because I and didn't have dough. it. And a dough. And yeah, a nice. I didn't have that at all. So that's one, like when I was at the United States, I didn't have any of these. And that was the most wretched experience. Tell me about that. Tell me about that at the UC. <laughs> Tell me about yeah, that. Yeah, it was a great, uh, I had a a great time that was even more electrifying than like Lala. Mm -hmm. So tell me no, about I, I take that back. It wasn't, but I still <laughs> loved, you know, you just see all those people like yeah. I touched the United Center stage. Like what was the uh, what was the event? Like what happened? What was it? That was uh Chance's concert. Mm -hmm. So I was up there, like I was doing my thing, but I did not the earpiece I didn't have one. I didn't get a chance to practice, mm -hmm. I didn't get a chance to do shit. So when I went out there, the sound was bouncing so much off of those speakers. And, mm -hmm. you know, if you're a singer, or if you've ever been in one of those big arenas, you know, that shit is not good for a singer. Because it just sounded like a bunch of different tones at one time. Mm -hmm. And I had trouble figuring out, am I on key or mm -hmm. not? I don't even know. I know right. I practiced this. Right. But, right. I don't, I can't but you can't tell, hear but yourself, right? It was a right? terrible idea to go out there without an earpiece. Mm -hmm. And nobody told me. They just... 
that's Let you go. kind of threw up there. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So that's one thing that I I would not ever do again and would advise against. <laughs> well, it comes with experience. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, you know now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know now. now. I'm like, okay, this is why they be keeping them yeah. curious again. Because <laughs> yeah. I don't know what, I don't know what was happening. If I didn't have my church training, mm. and my mom, <laughs> I would have been fucked. So I got off the stage and I told my friend, like, I did horrible. I'm like, I couldn't even, this is my first time I'm doing this. He's like, no, you didn't look. Mm -hmm. So I look at it and I'm still on key. So I'm like, oh, there's a rock. And you know, and it's just in your, <laughs> yeah. you know, at the I'm moment, it's in you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You tripping, but yeah. you know, you got it. You got this. No, I oh. wasn't tripping. That shit was, mm -hmm. that shit was hard. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's, it felt like I was tone deaf up there. Because it's so loud, you probably you can't hear shit. She was bouncing. But, yeah. So what we got next? I, will, I have no idea what that's like. And I probably, I won't be on stage Man. doing no singing. <laughs> Might talk some shit, though. Man. But listen, so the next one that we rolling with, you know what I'm saying? And the facts of law favorite foe. Yeah, one down. Let's go. a little bit about that one and you know them words go ahead yeah. then i hear you go ahead then <laughs> no that was a you know you got is that one it, it, tell us about why that one speaks to you yeah and just man i feel like we don't give people their flowers while they're here Counter say it blessings. again and yeah count your blessings that's another one i got on there it's just a reflective project overall mm -hmm. just uh where i've been where i'm going you know throughout my life how much faith i have in god that i will be where I need to be Facts. at the right time, you know. Um, but it, it's just a lot of times too. We feel like, oh, this person ain't they ain't hearing me. Like as artists, we be like, man, they they ain't answering my emails or they not answering my calls and this and that. Like mm -hmm. we can't really be focused on it. People, people got lives to go on. Yeah, gotta, and it's just a lot of cap and mm -hmm. shit. Yeah. So it ain't even a lie. Mm -hmm. They gonna respond who they want to respond mm -hmm. to. But it's um, it's just the fact that you can't focus on the people who are, you know, negative. You can't focus too much on the negative energy. You gotta focus on the people who are in your corner and who's willing to help. Make sure you utilize the resources that you do have. Go network. Do you? Yeah. <laughs> and Facts. it's better to help other people in their process than for you to be looking for your you know uh flowers at the end of the day if you don't get them i mean so what as long as you do what you need to do nobody know i give a homeless man you know ten dollars twenty dollars put him in the hotel room whatever right. you know it may be that you do on, on right. your own time mm -hmm. people ain't gonna give you no accolades for that you still you know as long as you know you did the right thing and that's kind of yeah. what roses is, roses. Is i like that you know that's something I, we was talking about last night you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Give them their roses, cause yeah. I mean, listen. As long as you're doing what you're supposed to, you you put out the right count. kind of energy. Yeah. Real yeah. shit. Yeah, you put out man. the right kind of energy, you're gonna get that back. It's gonna line. One way or another, you know what yeah. I'm saying? And not all the time. Sometimes when you do the right thing, you still be getting some bullshit. Oh, that's, that's they, it. It just ain't came back yet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's it ain't came back yet. The good will come. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You stay positive. You do the just right thing. You put out that good energy, yeah. that good positivity. You'll get that shit back. Yeah, I'm telling you. You'll get it. Oh, Hell yeah. so Real talk. You'll get it. Yeah. 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 I like that one. Who we got? Next. Who we got on next. Facts of Law favorite folk. Play it a little longer. You know, this is take a little minute. Say this will take a minute. Take a little minute. <laughs> yeah. Hey, we got That's time. Cause I wanna, you know, it's, it's culture. Let it breathe. Get to it. What's like, the name of this one? Count your blessings. Count your blessings. We just spoke it up. Yeah. yeah. You dig what I'm saying? I, this is my favorite track. You dig. 
Yeah. <laughs> you know, she wrong. You know yeah. when I first met you, I thought you was a little shy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I mean, you she was still get off that. She still yeah. give that off. You yeah, know? until you see her on stage. Is that yeah, when you feel like you open up? Out. Yeah, I'm a different person. Yeah. You know, you yeah. got an alter ego. Yeah. yeah. So what's what's your alter ego? You got a name for your alter ego? I mean, people just call me Shawsy, but Shawsy. That's just say shall be shawsy like that. Mm-hmm. I'm here like this and I get my clothes on for performance time yeah. and I'm like, hello, how are you doing? Right, ready to go. Yeah. You did. I like that. I like that. You know what I'm saying? One of the things that I also heard now, you say you froze up on camera? Yeah. Tell us about that. I always freeze because I'm just. You still shy, but you know what I'm saying? I don't know why I picked this profession. Or like, <laughs> it or picked like you. Broadcasting or like public speaking. I hate that shit. Yeah. Really? I so, get anxiety attacks. When do you think, <laughs> is there a specific time you're talking about that you froze up? Yeah, on Sway in the Morning. I, Word. That was a time where you should have been like, you know, ready. Mm-hmm. So, how you, when you say you Tell froze what up? What happened? Yeah. Well, first of all, it was my first time in New York. Well, it wasn't my first time, it was my. Second time, but the first time I went, I was doing So Far Sounds, and me and, you know, David, who I was talking about earlier, and the band, mm-hmm. and Paris, like, we all went there to to perform, but it was nothing like when I went the second time. Okay. Like, the second time, I'm meeting all these people, I'm at. Like who? MTV, I'm at Vibe, I'm at mm-hmm. all these places, I'm like, holy shit, I'm mm-hmm. like, I didn't even know all this stuff was here, I'm mm-hmm. like, what? You know, you just yeah, yeah, your yeah. eyes to a lot more. So when I get to Sway, you know, the night before, everybody was chilling, drinking, having a good time. They was all calm. Yeah. I'm like, oh, my God. They about to mm-hmm. make me go here and freestyle. I don't even freestyle. Ah, like that. Word. Why would they have me doing this? Uh-huh. I'm like, you know, Taylor Cool, he freestyle. He a dope-ass rapper. He can, mm-hmm. He's just born for the stage. Yeah. Like, I'm born for the stage, too. I just have to get over that initial, mm-hmm. like, fuck all that. I'm the shit like you gotta get there i'm there now but, right 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 you know but like, then how long ago was that you were saying yeah. i'm not it was, it was only like three years three ago. years ago well, and so what was no time be fine well, yeah time be like, fine especially when we had two down years that felt yeah. like one year you know what yeah. i'm saying yeah. i swear <laughs> I'm like but well, i think that was it that was like three years ago but when i get on there you know i'm seeing people come out the elevator i think i i seen like a snoop <laughs> mm. I went on the elevator it's Spike Lee um, wow then I'm out the elevator I see mm. more celebrities coming and then wow. I see Sway for the first time I see all these cameras like this but it was way more in a I'm here now you're like oh like, shit rap yeah <laughs> so I'm like yeah it's your moment so, it gets to my turn I'm nervous as hell I practiced like six raps that I've known for a long time yeah but when I went up there, this shit wouldn't come out. Mm. It just would, didn't come out. Yeah. So well, what, they, what they say, like... Man, I mean, they, I still did my thing. Yeah. Oh, so you sp- I'm doing this because I'm, you know, I, I'm a 
open book, you know, I could be vulnerable. I could say I fucked up and yeah. know, I'm gonna yeah, make yeah. sure I correct that shit the next time. Right, right, right. But, you know, in that moment, you know, I'm seeing Sway telling me, like, I heard your tracks. I think it's dope, you know, just make sure you keep going because it's only a couple thousand heard it. How many people are in the world? Don't give up on your music. Right. Right. You tell me that shit before I go up there. I'm oh, right. Nervous. He already making you nervous. <laughs> Thanks, Sway. <laughs> you ain't got you ain't the answer, Sway. Sway. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> How, Sway? <laughs> yeah. You did. You had to be a legend. They both yeah, legends. They legends. I don't want to let nobody down. Yeah. So I get up there. They playing the dude next to me. He rapping hard as hell. I right. Mean, Who was it? You remember? Just, you know, New York rappers. They yeah. <laughs> yeah, all that. <laughs> all that. <laughs> Bibi son. Bibi Bibi butt did it. What up, Don? My Tim, <laughs> my Tim, son. Like, like I'm gonna smoke you, nigga. Right, right, like, right. I did not smoke. You did not smoke. Them? I, I smoked a little bit of it, I, so I ain't gonna say I didn't do. I'm gonna have to pull that up. We, yeah. No, you not. I'm looking for that. No, we already no, listen. Hey, I don't know why. I ain't even hey, the team is already working on it. Yeah, though, right? yeah, no, it's real yeah, we, You got it. Nah, yeah. don't play that shit. Really. <laughs> I don't even want to see it. I've never seen it since. Oh, you haven't seen it? Since after that, because I, I told my uh, my friend Geronimo, and he, he actually, you know, got me started, too, on, on my career as far yeah. as, mm -hmm. you know, recording. But I'm like, man, I'm not posting that shit. I did terrible. He was like, B, I don't give a damn if you think you did terrible. You was on Sway in the morning. Real yeah. shit. God damn it. Who else did? Oh. Hey. People, can't a lot of people say they did say terrible. That. A lot of people yeah, can't so say that, yo. That's what you trying to tell me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he like, facts. He was just like, nah, no, I'm going to find a clip for you since you don't want to watch it. And you're going to post this on your Instagram. Did you ever post it? I did. You did I post it? I posted it like two, three times. And, and what happened? Everybody was posting the fire emojis. They like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come Girl. on now. But on the YouTube comments, they're like, man, how could you get on Sway and drop the ball? Whoa. Blah, 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 hey, blah. YouTube and a I, different animal, y'all. My, my brother even told me that. He was like, man, I seen that clip. I'm like, I know she could have did better than that. I'm like, well, you tell me what it's like when you get on <laughs> Real shit. Yeah, hey, real shit. Hey, listen. Hey, you put some lights, camera, Shots action, fired. people you've been watching for 15 years, and know. you know what I'm saying? Like, yo, it's a lot of pressure. You, hey. you ain't gonna know what it's like till you get there. Yeah. Like, don't tell me nothing. Mm -hmm. yeah. Don't tell me nothing. I respect. And wait till the second time. Wait till the next time. Yeah, I'll next Let's time. Let's get it. I'm, I'm all Let's now. get it. I done had enough of the lights and shit like that. Yeah, you get it now, huh? Look. Look how she's shining on these lights. <laughs> See, I'm here, baby. What's happening? So listen, we got another we'll one. We at, we at three? We at, where we, four? Yeah, we this four. is four already? Yeah. Damn, that went fast. So let's yeah, go. Yeah, it did go fast. You know, <laughs> <laughs> it was amazing. I had to... Look, she got to sit there and think. She's like, she like, what's this? <laughs> she like, this man's song? <laughs> right. What's this? Who picked this one? What's the name of this one? This name. I did. I did. I did. I did. I did. I did. Yep. <laughs> I like it. Hey, listen. It's on your album. I got I Hey, listen, that's real. 
Yeah. I, I that's know, real. You know, like this track, you know? No, I'm, I'm, it's on the project. Oh, why, yeah, I clearly yeah. liked it, but. Why is your said, least? Least favorite. Just. I like the, the message behind it. But it, like, the, it's vibey. Yeah. It's just my opinion. You're gonna turn From up. We turning shit. up. Yeah, you know how it go. You know. Least favorite on the album that made it. Let's go. But it's still but it still made it because I it's it's vibey and it's Lynn, like Lynn off girlfriend. My yeah, tell me about Lynn. Me. What was the name of it? My yeah. friends always tell me I'm I'm like Lynn because I do all this shit <laughs> and I can get a job so easy because my resume is still very well, you know, mm -hmm. reverse. So I can go in the entertainment world and make mm -hmm. my own or the corporate world to make my own and I think they just like why you, you went to school we got these degrees and you doing music I mean but that's man, you doing something you love <laughs> listen yo. them hey them degrees yo, let you do what paper you want. Yeah, man it's paper and I, and I be telling people like the ones who got the double masters and the PhD like I'll I'll go and get my doctors just so people can introduce me as Dr. Shaw like, Dr. Sh Dr. Shaw we need you <laughs> yeah. Dr. Yeah. Shaw can you take a look Dr. at this Dr. Shaw no it just was on the music tip <laughs> oh you gonna change your name again from to drum C to Dr. Shaw yeah. Gotta address me as Doc. Doc, let's get it. <laughs> I like that. That's what's up, yeah. You dig. But listen, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yo. I had a quick question. Let's go. Question. He got a question so from the what gallery. Was, uh, what was the inspiration behind the album cover with like the lady smoking a cigarette on the phone? Good question. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think it's dope. So I want to know what, what was your inspiration? Get a job. Right? I just wanted something that depicted women in. A light where we just have to be like this perfect being like you, we go to work we take care of the kids like it's okay to have an occasional like you know you can chill have your wine or a cigarette whatever you do to, to kind of get your peace and just the modern woman they you know it's changing from how it used to be back in the 50s and and the 60s so I kind of wanted to depict that on the, you think it's changing for the better the cover. I do I think it's changing for the better for, for women I mean, I think we're being celebrated more mm -hmm. um, and not just looked at as, like, cooking and cleaning. Like, y'all be making jokes, but it's funny because this shit is true. Like, some, some of the what shit, kind of like, jokes? when they... Man, I've seen something where they was like, what girls really be doing when they talking and everybody was cleaning up. Like, it was just like... You know, I'm just, just like, saying. Yeah. Like, you drinking while you, like, vacuuming and shit. But I also, like, I think the times are changing to where it's... Both parties just got to do the work because you can't expect me to go home and take care of the kids and clean and still work and you ain't giving me no money and then you get to do nothing. Well, hold on. And just work. You know. Yeah, we can talk about that. Later. I really yeah, don't we know. Do. I don't know nothing about right, that. Right, because yeah. now so my thing is, is <laughs> like me. Yeah, like right. I, I, I think in my house, I probably clean the most. Yeah. Like, and and I, it admirable. frustrates me when it's not like clean. You dig what I'm saying? Like I... Yeah, I, yeah, I like, have issues with women want a Danny Tanner, You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, but you know, that's the Virgo that's shit we the be Virgo talking about. Shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, my kids are Virgos. They're September When they birthday? September 4th. Fourth, I'm the third. I was, yeah. hey, you did. And, and for real, hey, like, let's go. I like them. I like them. Yeah. She's like, oh, mom, you forgot this. Yeah, <laughs> you, in other words, mom, you need to. Tidy right, it up. Right. Close that drawer. But I should pick it up after that, but they only seven. They kids. You know what I'm saying? Leo gang. Right, that's Leo true. Gang. You Leo Gang. Yeah, August 4th. August 14th. Gang, yeah. gang. I see y'all. I see y'all. You know what I'm saying? Well, you got three Virgos in the room right now. <laughs> you did third, third, fourth, sixteenth. Well, well it's only two. I was it's third. We right. third that I'm talking relax. about. The twins, and that's a relax. <laughs> twins, so that's two. So it's four of us. It's four of them. Tino, Tino is a, a Virgo. When your birthday? Sixteenth. Sixteenth. Well. Oh, okay. September. Yeah. Yep, but yeah, but y'all yeah. true Virgos. Cause mm. I got a friend who's like a twenty first. Mm. Nah, she a little different. Too, that's yeah. Too yeah. yeah, that's why. Like, yeah, you know, <laughs> that's, that's, like, like, that's, that's, that's how I look at July like Leos. <laughs> Man, my sister's a July Leo. I be looking at him like <laughs> twenty. <"Twins." laughs> <laughs> ain't real. I'm like, you a Cancer Leo? Cause she used to be so sensitive, man. I, like, I, I wish I had feelings. <laughs> hey, hey, hey! Listen, I tell you, cause that Virgo shit, we be pretty cut and dry. Yeah. You know what really? I'm saying? It's yeah. this. Well, you gotta tell me how to deal with with the Virgo boys. Oh, um, uh, well, you can tell me now. I think they are. I'm saying, I don't know. Women, male. I think same. they are. My cousin is a Virgo. Like, you know, I don't know. Need I, his space. He just like. <laughs> need his space, but you still need to be there. 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yo, yeah. even when they wrong, they they think they. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You know they're wrong. Whoa, whoa! Virgos are never wrong. Right, no, y'all. Experience. Yo, Virgos are never wrong, y'all. See what I'm saying? Because I'm like, because <laughs> I'm like, hey, get your hand out your mouth. Don't do that. But I didn't put my hand in my mouth. <laughs> yes, you did. Fam, I'm looking at you. Right. Right. So, I'm, so I'm dumb or a liar, so I'm going blind. So, I go through it like every day, so. Yeah. Oh, y'all. Yeah. All right. Hey, 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 hey. Y'all gotta give me some pointers because I, I'm gonna have to. I might lose it. Got the girl and a boy right now. Hey, listen. You <laughs> got. You hit the. You hit a a, a perfect. I did. Shot. I had the boys. Boy and a girl. Once one and done, you out of there. Hey, yeah. I, you having any boys? This, you though. think? Um. I mean, if my. If, if my husband really wants one, you will. You will. I will do it. Okay, yeah. gotcha. But okay. otherwise, no. I'm what if it's another set of goals, twins, man? It would possibly happen to me. Yeah, I mean, I can see that. You know yeah. what I'm saying? When you said it earlier, another so, set of twins. Listen, I was, I was what, just saying, what if? Oh, I was like, because when you said you had a young, uh, younger sibling set of twins, mm-hmm. I was like, damn, because I already knew you had yeah. the twins. So I'm like, damn. Hey, yeah, you know? No, it might just. Very well be when I first found out I was having, so I'm like, it would be. You're like, of course, me, what? right? You know what I'm saying? You count the numbers who is skipped, you know what I'm saying? I would be. And you got cousins too that are twins, right? That's just hey. Yeah, it's a few of them. But I'm like, dang, God, I just have to just do this on me, huh? Yeah, he don't, hey, he wanted you to have to just be pregnant for two that one time. I'm glad. You yeah, feel me? Like, he, he was working with you. He knew your <laughs> career was here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you know, you need both yeah, of them babies. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? So there yeah. you go. That's what's up, man. Yeah. So one what you got, brother? We good. We, we great. Yeah, we, we good. good. What you yeah. got? You got any questions for us? I, I mean, I always have questions. Like, Let's get it. Let's go. I got. I got to think of what I want to ask now. Well, you can. It's just on the spot. What about I, our questions? I, I guess since we got an artist, we can ask maybe some top fives, top five. Let's go with that. Favorite singers and top five favorite rappers. Well, we did go with you had Lauren oh, Hill. Did. Yeah, we you did had Lauren Hill. Um, Missy, Missy, and Missy. Then Erica, Eve. I think Eve get overlooked. I like Maya. Um, she okay. was back then. I thought she hey, was listen. amazing. I, listen, you? when Maya had that joint with oh, Cisco, hold up. When Maya had that joint with Cisco, that video. Don song. No, 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 no. Maya was I didn't the one. Want to say that. It was <laughs> right. You see the one? I just remember the it, shit with uh, with Jay Z, the Shocker. Oh, was, which one was that? Oh, man. Uh, First of all, Silk that name was like size four. Silk the four. Oh, listen, <laughs> the best of me verse with Jay killed that was hard. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. And then she had the video when she came out with Cisco. She had on. I can't remember that. Listen, one. I was a Maya fan. I used to watch the video like. I mean, everybody yeah. loved Maya yeah. though. Yeah, I was like, damn. Yeah, people forget about her. Her and Eve, like they just be sliding under sometimes because they had a shorter Pe- career because they Eve, went with the but, bullshit. But I'm saying Eve. I think she chose to have a shorter. Career. She definitely did. Yeah, Eve, yeah, Eve, yeah. Eve had, I but Maya but Eve was fire though. Eve also like people forget she had a whole series that was dope, a TV, oh, a TV show. show yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It was actually EVE, good. E V E. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. Like and that went for at least three seasons, I think. You know what I'm saying? On what was it? W B uh, uh, U P N or something? I'm talking about W B B M. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, yeah. yeah, you know what I'm saying? Then she had, you know, the song. She had a nice career, and then she went and got Buddy ass. And, you know, she got paid. Hey, you hate? She got that. I am. I mean, hey, hey, look, Wait, because, hey, look, I said song what? Uh, a couple weeks ago. Why? A couple weeks ago about uh Serena. Yeah, why? Why? Hey, listen. I'm just Tell saying. Why. Listen, I'm the type. Listen, I, hey, look. Hey, I, I, I say it. I said it. Feel, I'm, 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 I'm pro black, like. I feel like black and black should be together. Oh, what if, hey, for me, I you say... just find who treats you right? Because that's, that's, well, that's what I look for. Listen, who treat me right? Who I mean, I, I get it. My ass. I'm yeah, not I, mad at her. I get it. I get it. You know what I'm saying? But that mm-hmm. also means, like, you know, if you can find somebody of any pigment that can treat you right, I'm sure you can find a brother that can you dig what I'm saying? Wait. Like one thing that I say, hey, they everywhere. What, what, what listen, don't go there. Hey, what did we you go say there. Episode two. What did you say? Episode hey, listen, two. You, I said, you it said episode put two, yourself three, in four. Those listen, environments. Best, best thing. That's true. Best thing that That's you can do is get with a black man, have some black babies, build these black families, and keep it pushing. You know what I'm saying? That's mm-hmm. how we grow us because it starts at home. We have to make sure that we are putting the best representation forward out here you know what i'm saying when we want to build this generational wealth we want to build it with families that look like us because those are the ones that are in need that need it you know what i'm saying you can go make these billions of dollars but when you get with families that are not of your culture 
their culture is go- going to be the ones to benefit yeah, off those billions. Mm-hmm. You dig what I'm saying? So now that's putting us even further back. You know what I'm saying? So it's we one put of, like your boy. Back. Well, we also started Easy. behind the line for 100 years. That's, the starting that line is, is way true, up there. But you dig? That yeah. is true. Uh, but now. You know, we have the education, we have the resources to better ourselves. Of course. And to, but, but it's so many of us that's so far gone. You'd be like, yeah, damn, I thought we was <laughs> yeah, growing. Yeah. But the reason why we think we're growing is because we around like-minded individuals. Like, y'all are like-minded We We have some that are climbing up out of it. But you got to remember, too, we're it still far behind. Yeah, it takes, yeah, a, you I know, 400 that. years of being oppressed exactly. puts you in a certain starting point. Mm-hmm. So now the the disadvantage upper, upper mm-hmm. echelon, yeah, we're gonna have the opportunity to start moving forward. Mm-hmm. I'm putting my children in ten times better position than, than my parents put us in. Right. Exactly, my parents did us right. great. They did the best they could. So time, we have to pay yeah, it exactly. But but I'm saying, but we have to just pay it forward and do the best exactly. that we can for those. Exactly. A lot of the people that we compete with are trust fund babies. Whereas our parents didn't know shit about a trust fund. They just trying to make it out this whole thing. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? What people were saying about Trump, not to get off the subject. No, it's good. About yeah. Trump. Like, at least Trump told y'all that he was racist <laughs> through his he, actions you know, he, and, or prejudice, whatever you want to call it. But I don't even think it's that. I just think it's that he didn't know no better. He was born with the silver spoon. I'm going to play now. devil's advocate. He's never been. Pink, yeah. you, really think, you really think yeah. he was racist? Yes. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Why do you think he was racist? He just don't know. <laughs> He don't know. That's why we was talking about with experiences. He would never know what that's like. And I'm not trying. I'm not trying to. I feel like he didn't care. It's not his. It's not. I feel like it's not his business to care. It doesn't matter to him. No. Why? He never. It's not going to change his life. It doesn't really have a real bearing on him. He don't care about shit, (laughs) but itself. Like he he told us, "What do you got to lose? What do you got to lose?" I'm like, damn. You right. man, like, you don't what have do we got to lose? You know what I'm saying? Real shit. You don't so, have you know. nothing. You right, Trump. But you, you know, know, it's hey. Here's my thing. You get people in power. You for me <laughs> for you to be the president. I just want to have somebody there that represents us well throughout Absolutely. the bullshit. Yeah. I feel like he didn't represent us well. I don't mm-hmm. think. I, but I don't. I don't think. I don't think Biden, Biden does either. either. But at the same time, yeah, I also do. don't think. You know, in that same yeah, breath, right. I don't think he represents us well. But I don't think that he's also making us look like imbeciles. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you gotta like. But like, would you well, rather somebody that's in the closet? Because that's why. Right. Would you rather somebody in the closet or just who's out in the open saying, "Yeah, I know, I listen, don't care bro, about y'all, but listen, I will help listen, you." Listen, bro. I can I can say this like. What if he do care though? Like Biden. What if he do care, but he can't get nothing accomplished because. Because of the way the politics Senate, are set up. And, yeah, because but that's the same thing with Trump and the same thing with Obama. But Trump, I don't know if Trump tried to get stuff done. Yeah, he did. Us. He, he shut for up. us? No, not for us. No, I'm saying, I'm saying for us. Yeah, yeah. I'm saying what it is is it wouldn't matter either way because we're gonna fight with him. The the the, the shit is basically nice. split down the middle for like one or two people over the aisle. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's like, yo, if we gonna have if we gonna be running it, they gonna fight every tooth and nail. So we ain't going to barely be able to get shit done and vice versa. That's what we saw Obama, then Trump, then t- Biden. It's, it's the same Trump shit. Had, had him. Trump had him. What do you he mean? Had the, he had the... Uh, but they, he still couldn't pass shit because we wasn't letting shit go either. No, Trump yeah. was able it to... Was, he was able to eliminate shit, but he couldn't yeah, really he, pass the laws. Once it was again, or whatever Obama... Like, get that shit up out yeah, of here. Yeah, you can get rid of shit, <laughs> but impl- implementing your new shit is harder. You know what I'm saying? Because the house if is If you don't have the house, mm-hmm. it's harder. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So what we working with right now is a split house. And it is harder when you got two Democrats that's like, I'm with, I'm on the side of the Republicans. Yeah. So and it's it, kind of hard. You know what I mean? Bro, but if they was riding, we will be able to, well, Biden would be able to get stuff done. But I feel like I'm not really. I don't a, know, man. It ain't like he. I don't think he really, really fight for like the George Floyd uh, act. What was it? Bro, I don't even. Trump is a businessman. Yeah, care. that's, that's why everybody. Business. That's why a lot of people loved him because he was a businessman. He wasn't even a good businessman. Yeah, I don't the think motherfucker so that either. went bankrupt like seven times to kind of get out of paying people. You know what I'm saying? Like people be like, he a businessman. I mean, he a businessman. That's they, what I'm saying. And he they go bankrupt. Purposely, yeah, yeah, but that does, so making us go bankrupt purposely is not a good thing, because he's the only one that benefits. You take all the money and then run from it. 
So what do you think makes a good businessman? Because you're looking out for yourself. Yeah, (laughs) it's a good business. But when you over the country, you got to look out for the country. Fuck fuck all these politics. Fuck all these politics. (laughs) Fuck all these politics. What what questions you had? Oh yeah, my. I was gonna ask what's a what's a top five singers and top five rappers. I think we blended it. Oh yeah, we did. We did blend them up. So I was. Uh, she just did again Eminem. like Eminem. Okay, um, okay. I, I didn't say Eminem, but everybody knows that's like one of my favorite people ever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Just because he was just so raw with his vocal, his lyrics, and his storytelling, I thought it was amazing. Mm-hmm. You got a favorite um, song from him? Because I, yeah. I got one. We <laughs> talked about it a little earlier. <laughs> Which one is yours? Renegade. Him and Renegade. Jay. Okay, I like yeah. that song. I like that one because it was rock infused. And I've always liked. Um, I listen to rock a lot. Mm-hmm. My parents would be like, "What's all that white music?" You <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not I even get it. white music. It's our music. <laughs> now, <laughs> like, don't 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 take offense to this, right? Mm-hmm. Um, that means it's gonna. That, be I, I, I was no use about to say that. <laughs> but when I listen, when I listen to some of your album, I like I could hear like Kid Cudi. I don't I know never heard you, of that, but I don't take offense to it. I don't know if you rock with him. You rock with Kid Cudi? I do, but I've never like listened to whole projects. Or, okay, uh, yeah, okay. So that was just my opinion. That's dope. No, I, I mean now I'm gonna listen to Kid Cudi. I was gonna say I've never <laughs> really listened to Kid Cudi, yeah, so Kid I, Cudi. I couldn't, I couldn't agree on it. My not. opinion, mm-hmm. Kid Cudi is fire, but you know, I like that's just Kanye. my opinion. You entitled to your I opinion? Yeah, I mean, you know, a lot of people. Kanye? Yeah, he don't. Everybody That's love Kanye. <laughs> of course. Well, well, everybody. Man, come on, man. Like, come look, every on, time man. you say Kanye, now it's like controversial. Listen, man. Like, come on now. Like, I like the old. I know. I like the old Kanye. Kanye. <laughs> What's the bar he say? Hey, what he say? He had a whole track. Yeah, the whole, uh, the old Kanye. Kanye yeah. Say what you want, Kanye. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's the one I like. Yeah, that Kanye was fucking dope, man. But I still think Kanye is dope as an artist. Our personal life, that ain't none of my business. But as an artist, I feel like Kanye, to me, and people can kill me if they want to, Kanye top five to me he as is. an artist. Yep. Okay. I as can an do artist, that. man. I have a difference. He just things. moved into my top five after I watched the documentary, though. Um, he wasn't in my top five. That sounds a, that sounds a little questionable. Top two. Wow, what was your top five? Dude? So my top five. Oh, my top five. No, don't, is, here we go. It's not like here everybody else. Okay, let me hear. So so, I got NAS. Okay. I got. Of course. <laughs> you just a goat. <laughs> like nah. I got fifty in my five. top five. Oh, 50 I got pretty like gang. We coming on the real. I got fifty. I got Jay. Of course. I got uh, Common. Mm-hmm. And who was my fifth? Kanye? Yeah, well, Kanye just moved into my five no, once I watched the documentary. Like that. Um, who was my <laughs> fifth? Shit, Kendrick. Mm-hmm. All right, so but, but no, no, no. I'm fucking lying. Pac was in my five. I'm going to say, hey, so here go my top five. Tweaking. Top five dead or alive. I got Pac. I got Big. I got Jay. I got Twister. And I got... <sighs> fucking Eminem. Now I'm I saying that's... Like, that's I and I mean, you, that's man. to me, that's lyrically like, like spitting, like niggas but, really getting to it. The reason I ain't named Pac because I don't name Pac no more. Like Pac, he, it's like it's evident. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's like Pac is on a whole different. It's different. It's a different stratosphere. That's why I ain't I ain't say Pac, but like like Pac and Biggie, they just they two artists that's just like yeah, and you know, and that's what I said. So and I didn't even say Big. I did say you Big. Said I big. said Pac, Big, J, M, Twist. Yeah. I like that. And then six. If I go with six, I'm going to say Big Snoop Dogg. You know what I'm saying? People say what they want. People got to... Listen, Big Snoop Dogg. I'm putting him right there. Snoop Um, Dogg is like the LeBron James. Hey, real shit. He might not be your goat, but he got all the stats. Longevity, y'all. You know what I'm saying? He got all the stats. You dig what I'm saying? He's just so cool and calm. Hey, hey. That man can do this. He can do this shit till he 80, bro. Yeah, yeah. You feel me? He ain't have to change himself. He He ain't changed. He did change. No, bro. He's still I mean, the same nigga. He he ain't the same, bro. I think so. Nobody like, is the same. Right, nobody is the same. He, listen, you got to remember, Snoop, what you mean, Snoop was like him. 
He's 90 not Snoop his core, his and, core values. Bro, like, think about it. Snoop ain't never really been this. He ain't never really been different. Think about it. Yes, he did. In what aspect? He ain't killing niggas on tracks no more? Bro. He might. He'll still talk about smoking a nigga if he needs to. Nah, not really. Yeah, not, like, not, not like not like the 90s. Yeah, not like the 90s, bro. Hey, listen Hey, listen to that album. Gangsta and the Gentleman. You ever heard that one? Come on, man. I, I'm a big Snoop. <laughs> big Snoop Dogg. That was the first <laughs> album I bought with my money with Dogg. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? First money, first album I bought with my money, knew every name? word, word for word. I mean, I remember rapping it uh, in a tape deck. You know what I'm saying? In, in the in city, what, Bro, what was it? The you Walkman. can't listen to that whole album in the Walkman, bro. front to back. You can't. Boy, you crazy? You I cannot. Know, I know that whole album front. You can't. But I'm saying, I know you may know it, but every song on that album ain't ain't good, bro. To you, <laughs> to you. <laughs> But it's hey, all it's, it's all, all subjective. subjective. It's yeah. it's music. All it's subjective. You got songs. There ain't hey, no way in hell he can say. His hey, listen. Can say his favorite our, his favorite rapper is Kendrick, and I can't stand him. Yeah, I said it on here. So why you, heard you can't me. stand Kendrick? I want to know. Uh, honestly, I don't like his flow. The the animated. Yeah, so you it, don't like animation. I feel like he does it more than he needs to, and it's not. I feel like <laughs> it's. You know but you just say you like Eminem. Exactly, but I mean, it was one of the most animated artists. I get it. <laughs> I get <laughs> him. Bustle rhymes. I mean, like these some animated yeah. artists, man. It's not a hey, sorry, not a Kendrick fan. And, and Eminem was in your top five. I, yeah. I could have sworn I, you I said like that. I like him. He spits. I like him. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Do. This is also subjective. Hey, man. Hey, look. My no, opinion hey, is look, I don't care about no subjective. He does. Though. I just think he babbles a lot. I feel like he's a hypocrite. He be saying, uh, he'll go 14 <laughs> bars and not really be saying it. <laughs> he say, bro, no he's saying, he's babbling. He be babbling. He don't waste the bars. <laughs> he definitely wastes hey, bars. You can't be, no, I'm not, I'm not going. I'm not going. That ain't no opinion. That ain't no opinion, man. You heard what I said. You heard what I said. You hey, can't say hey, listen. No hey, come bar. argue with me about it, Kendrick. Kendrick if you don't like it, do come you sit like on Kendrick? the couch. I love Kendrick. I like Kendrick. Kendrick hey, listen. Everybody's top five. I'm hey, I'm gonna tell you just like, like this, and I'm gonna put. Too. Baby I'm gonna tell you just like crazy. this. That's Kendrick Baby Jordan. King yeah. is crazy. Hey, I'm gonna tell you just like this, and when it come down to it, if we put him in a battle, I'm taking Lupe over Kendrick every day, all day. Hey, Let's look, get it. Chicago. Lupe in another league. Okay. Let's go, Chicago, all day, every day. With Lupe at all. You heard me. Hey, look, I love Lupe. That's my dog. But, but Kendrick can't Shout keep out up. Lou. Lupe is a beast, beast. But Kendrick can't keep up. I think they I'm can not keep gonna up say Kendrick together. is better than. I'm not about to sit here and say Kendrick is better than Lupe because did, food and liquor was that, amazing. Food and liquor stores. Hey, listen. Shout out the homie. Food and liquor was amazing. Shout out the homie. Like I hate when people compare Mike and LeBron. Like they in two different yeah, eras. Two different they different just. Era. But but you think Lupe and Kendrick in two different eras? Yes, yes. Okay. That was two thousand seven. That's two different eras. What do you mean? He's still that was like rapping though. That's that like two thousand six. He's still rapping though. It, not really. Yeah, he's still, he's still rapping though. Well, Look, I'm just gonna say this. Listen, <laughs> make sure y'all get out here to the Hyde Park uh, Music Festival. We'll be there. And we rocking with the boy Lupe. Listen, so we'll see listen, you soon. man. Hey, look, look, man. I love Lupe. I love Lupe. But, but him, I heard the no, play. no, 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 no. But, but <laughs> him and Kendrick are two different eras. I'm just they're saying. not in the same they're era. Jay Z still rapping. Jay Z ain't the same era as Kendrick. I don't know. Hey, and Kendrick walked Jay Z down. Here he go. That's some youngsters <laughs> talking behind the camera. Kendrick. My, my favorite Kendrick. artist. Yeah, you can do your top five. Kendrick or Kanye. Uh, my top five is <laughs> Kendrick or Kanye. Kanye number one for sure. Kendrick number two. Kendrick number two. And then I got matters. Pop. Then I got Ho. Then I got Big. I then, I, then I gotta, I, I gotta put, that, I gotta put in Drake. Oh, but damn, when I put Drake into, Drake. I, like Drake, I, 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 I kind of ascend Drake in, when I talk about. I could put Drake, Drake in my top five or top top five six artist of all time because he got a whole R and B catalog that you gotta mention. Too. And you know what? He is and outside he, of just as good as he is. He moves right. with the times. Listen, too. You know what I'm saying? no matter he how we love stuck. Drake, I love Drake, bro. Yeah. Drake don't got a classic. A classic Drake, yeah, album. Played it. What about that, brand no, new? No, 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 no. This the album. I'm saying a classic album. I would say, say Views See? is a classic album, but it's not a classic rap album. And then Take Care is also a classic album. Man. Well, I'm going to sit this one out. Cla- Y'all like already you know. It's not, it's not my thing, baby. I'm going to sit this one out. I, I would say Drake. I could see how, because, you know, people say, like, Drake don't got the conventional 
10 track rap album right, rapping right. on each song. No, but That's I think no, I but, but I think Drake could make a classic yeah. with Drake rapping and singing. Yeah, like, That's what I'm saying. Doing he could do that. Him up. But I feel like he just he more than that. You know what I'm saying? I put it in my Want one thing? Why can't y'all just take a vibe? Hey man. What we got another gotta one. Be all we'll have, we got another one, man. What another great episode? Yeah. I mean, cause that's what we do is facts and law. This nah. the this the first With episode. Bianca Shaw. Shaw yeah. you yeah. dig. This the first one that you know we we went off a little bit into <laughs> some other stuff. But hey, that's cool. You know, because we could do what we, we want. It's our show. You know what I mean? Um, Bianca Shaw, rapper, Chelsea. singer, songwriter, drum seat. That ghostwriting <laughs> stuff, yo, I didn't know about that, but you know, that's another yeah, story. Ghostwriters really don't talk <laughs> about that. You know, um, what's your next show you got coming up? Tell the people. I don't got no next show. What you mean? Oh, we we work. We trying to find a show. Yeah, we can find a show. All right, let's find a show. So we got some coming. I got no next show. What's well, your, that I that I can think of. That I you think. can think of. All right, what's the next thing that? Look on my calendar. Tell tell the fans where you want them to check your 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 um your your, your music at. Your catalog. Actually, I take that back. Say that again. What's your next show? What's your next show? <laughs> Say it again. What's your next show? <laughs> Not like that. Oh, hey, my bad. Like, hey. So what's your next show? Hey, hey, like, hey what's, your, what's your next show? That was better, y'all. No, man. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> what's all right, your, forget it. Yeah. Y'all right, so, edit it out. You know, we're going to keep the all that. What's your next keep show? Keeping it. Keep it. Come on, man. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> What I, is no, it? I was just gonna say to follow me um, for my next show Gang. updates. So just yeah, follow me on Instagram and um, where's that? What? Where it? At Bianca Shaw Music on Instagram. At IG. Bianca Shaw Music on Twitter, Facebook, <laughs> and Bianca Shaw dot com. Just for spell it out. Updates. What's that? B I A N C A S H A W. I didn't know you do spoken word. You know it. You did. Give me some. Give me some. I love. <laughs> you dig? Check it. You know another great you one. You got the rap. Nah, I can't rap. Ch- 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 we got some. Hey, we got some. We got some lost. We, got, we, got lost footage, we might have but... had some drunken, terrible freestyles. <laughs> hey, we, we got some lost them. footage. But, you yeah, know, you feel me? Y'all maybe might not maybe see that. you gonna have to pay to see that. One. Ew, ooh, ooh, <laughs> pay per view. You dig? Check it. You know. Say, uh, just one more thing. No, What's up? Four seventeen. I remember. I have. Um, it's something called karaoke storyteller. So ooh. I'll be telling a story and a little bit of comedy. For ten minutes, and then I'll do a, a song after that. Where's that? So, um, you gotta follow me to find out. And hey, we on that. Follow Bianca Show. Follow show. I'll April follow 17th. you on IG. Listen, four seventeen. That's April seventeenth. I think that's what a Sunday. Yeah, it's a Sunday, Today, right? You. Yeah. yeah, it's a Sunday, <laughs> y'all. Let's get it. We let's let's go show some support. Yes, sir. To one of our family members from the Facts and Law podcast, Miss mm-hmm. Bianca Show. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Thank you y'all did. for having me. I really appreciate it. Hey, we appreciate you coming. It's you been know what I'm saying? fun. Thank y'all for staying. I know, you know, everybody got lives and work to do, but oh, I this appreciate what we do. This is the work. Yeah, it's Wednesday. You we did. Don't, it's Wednesday. Hey, so and we know I don't know if got. y'all was counting, but we went through some bottles of wine, too, didn't we, y'all? I ain't counting. <laughs> gang, gang, gang. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, Yo, I ain't counting. Y'all know what it is, man. Facts and law. Again, go to the YouTube page, Facts and Law, on YouTube. Hit the subscribe. Hit the notification bell. You watch the video, hit like. Leave a comment. Share that shit. Share it. It means a lot to us. You know what I'm saying? We steady growing. <laughs> Y'all see what we did today. You know what I'm saying? It speaks for itself. You got something? That's all for me, baby. Y'all already know. Life is good. I'm trying to Y'all tell you. Y'all gotta get him a piece of advice, though. Oh, we got a piece of advice. Don't piece eat yellow snow. Don't eat yellow snow. Yeah. Don't eat yellow snow. <laughs> <laughs> Better wrap it up before you fuck that up. Let's go, baby.